Hey guys, so at this point I'm gonna show you guys how to update your 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 gem. Um I made a crypto price CLI, but at this point I'm in version 1.4. Uh currently I'm going to version 1.5 and I'm gonna just gonna show you really quick how uh I'm plan I'm planning on doing this. Um so yeah, let's go ahead. So here, here's the program uh, that I previously showed you. It's still there. So uh, I guess the first thing we gotta do is actually go into the files of the version. But once you once you set up your CLI, there's a version file, and I already changed it to manually. I'm well, I, I just did that to version five. I was in 1.4, now in version 1.5, right? Let me just zoom in. Oh, zoom in a little more. So yeah, so you gotta go to your version and change it right here that's it so i'm i'm changing it to 1.5 because that's that's where that's where i want to be right now let me just close this a little more to be honest i don't need it uh so yeah let's let's continue with that so at this point uh i'm gonna say jump build and then you gotta give it the pr the, the the name what was it crypto price I believe when when you when you first actually start building the gem, you're gonna have to log in. You're first gonna have to create actually a an account, uh, preferably that you create an account right before you, you even actually do this. Go to to the website uh, right here, uh, create an account. Uh, so once you get prompted down here when you say gem build crypto, it's gonna ask you to log in. I believe I'm already logged in. Uh, hopefully I am. Uh, yeah, let's see what happens. What did it say? Uh, so yeah, jump build crypto price. It gave me some weird stuff down here. Warning open dependency, blah blah blah. It's not recommended. Use boundary requirements such as okay, okay. So for this, this crypto price, I, I'm not really too worried about security. Um, it's just a more of a kind of practice gem. I mean, if you can use it and if it's beneficial to you, to be honest, like that's awesome. But yeah, let's see. Let's see if it's updated. Uh, so I don't see anything. Oh, that's right. Cause we got to push it. So we got to say jump push, uh, crypto. I always forget crypto price 1.5 no hold on it's dot no it's zero dot 1.5 dot gem i believe that's 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 all i need uh let's see if it works successfully cool awesome it went up now let's see if it's actually up it should be right awesome so there you go uh that's how you you that's how you publish your 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 gem your ruby gem up into rubygems.org and same same thing if you if you want to update it so let's recap real quick when you want to update your version do the work that you got to do for example i did some work here in my cli and my coin and my scraper but i'm here in my version you just up update the version so next time i do something i would say 1.6 but i'm still 1.5 right now i haven't done any changes the first command that i did was gem build crypto price down here as you can see all the way down here and then my second command was, let's see, there we go. Uh, this, this this is how you gotta you gotta uh, phrase it. Gem push, the name of your gem uh, a dash uh, zero uh, dot, and if you're still in version number one overall, then use that. I guess you know this is just the one zero one point five. You just gotta put the little dash right here. Same same number as this right here dash zero one point five and then dot jump and you are good to go so take it easy and let me know if it's beneficial to you or if you want to use it for something uh more than happy to to work on it uh peace